All right. And five, four, three, two, one. Action. Tonight, we are honoring Joe Montana with the 2012 Activist Award. You may know him as David Rossi from the hit show Criminal Minds, or as Joey Zaza from The Godfather 3, or maybe even as Dean Martin in The Rat Pack. I just call him Dad. And I'd like to tell you a little bit about him. When I was two years old, I was diagnosed with autism. My family didn't know much about autism and at first were frightened and unsure of what to do. But being the strong people they are, they got involved in the special needs community and learned everything possible. Since then, my father has dedicated himself to helping autism charities all over the country. <coughs> He's hosted several golf tournaments, dinners, auctions, many other fundraising events. He spends part of his free time at schools like the Help Group, Performing Arts Studio with or including film. Talking to kids like me about filmmaking, acting and directing or just being a parent. It's always such a thrill for students to have access to someone like him and he is always so happy to be there. For the past five years, he has been a spokesperson for Easter Seals Therapeutic School and Center for Autism Research in Chicago. A facility that was constructed with my father's help and delivers state-of-the-art therapy for speech and language as well as occupational and applied behavior therapy. Three years ago, he did a very successful public service announcement for Act Today for Military Families. That PSA have helped raise a lot of money, which benefits kids and military personnel who are on the spectrum. He's also hosted the Act Today Golf Tournament three years in a row. Over the last 25 years, he worked with a variety of groups that ultimately combined to create Autism Speaks. All for one reason, to help raise awareness and someday find the cause and eventually the cure for autism. I guess you might think he's doing it for me. But if you knew my dad like I do, you would know he's doing it for every parent who learns their child has autism. I'm sure he would be the first to tell you that he doesn't deserve this award alone. My mother Arlene has also devoted much of her time money and passion to a variety of autism charities and organizations. They do this while working on a TV show, running a successful restaurant, and at the same time raising me and my sister Gia. Where did they get the energy? So on behalf of the autism community, thank you dad for all you have done and continue to do so that kids with autism from every walk of life can have a voice. You so richly deserve this award tonight. 